cello. This is Mini Queen Gomez, and I've been practicing on some brown paper at work on my eyebrows. So, with a pen and some basic brown paper that you roll out and dry your hands with. So, this is what I've drawn so far. I'm not trying to be perfect right now, but I'm trying to like just get the the vibe and I was running out of ink right there so right here too but trying to get the strokes down and then of course I get all these right here practice practice right Mac just trying to get her strokes down but yeah I did all these and I try not to be so thick and aggressive like I was with the first sheet. So trying to draw these eyebrows and get the, the hang and feel of it. But yeah. This is not the actual eyebrows, but just like the strokes, just getting down the strokes and then start working on the measuring of these eyebrows. But so far, this is what I've done, and just practice. I keep on practicing training because, of course, it needs to be really, uh, what is it, straight? The lines I need to be accurate, and the first time I did was too thick. If I turn it around, you'll see how it's not supposed to cut through the back, and so... When I turn this around, you'll see like all these ripped eyebrows all the way through and that that's way too heavy on the eyebrows. You can actually hurt your own eyebrows if you try that or you can injure someone really bad. But yeah, those ones I pushed too hard and it ripped all the way through. And you're supposed to actually, and I've been watching other YouTube videos also training for this one. You're supposed, and I did a lot of messed up, oh, I broke a nail right there. But you're supposed to not do X's and zigzags the way I did right here. I did a lot of mistakes, but, and then I went outside of the line here. So I'm just going to keep on practicing this. Um... And then go on to my my notebooks and stuff like that and keep on going at it. And see, of course, I'm going to also be measuring soon. I'm just doing like a basic, like, like practice and stroke. I'm just trying to get more familiar with the way the hairlines are. But in this sketch, if you notice... The front is very, like, the, the strokes are very small. Over here, I did them wider and bigger. And you're not supposed to cross X. And I just wanted to scribble like that and just to, because I know it's brown paper. It's not on anyone's skin right now. So I just wanted to see what it would look like. So I did that. So, and then I didn't even match all these eyebrows. Uh, I just did like this way, that way, tried to copy the sketch, but trying to get a feel about how, how to do this. And so, yeah, I'm just been practicing and just keep going at it and then with the hair strokes and get familiar with all that. But yeah, did all these, a lot of work I've been Work, work, work. So I'm just going to continue trying to do that and see how I'm going to get better at this eventually. It takes practice. I mean, of course, nothing. It's like learning how to cook rice or potatoes or uh, fried, fried potatoes. You're not going to know what to do right away. When you see a rice bag, what do you do? When you first try to learn how to cook a rice bag, you look at it and it's dry, right? And you're like, how the fuck, mama, do I, do I cook this? You know, do I boil, fry, what do I do, what do I add? 
Do I put it on high, low flame? When you first start something, it's always going to be tacky, miserable, and raw. It's not going to come out right. It's not going to be as accurate as you hoped it would be. So this, in this scenario, it's that situation with these brows is not coming out as accurate and I have to study more and practice and train more for this type of method so I can get better. But my strokes have gotten better. Um, I'm doing like actual eyebrow strokes now. So, and this one I just wanted to scribble it so I just like, ah, you know, I didn't go all psycho though. I mean, I, if I wanted to go, like, really crazy on these eyebrows, I would have just cut them into pieces and then scratched the whole crap out of it. Maybe even light a match to it and watch them burn, right? But, you know, and there's other things I could have done. But, no, I, I tried to keep in the lines and I tried to, to, you know, get an idea about how to do these strokes. Over here, too, I did, like like, little arrows, if you can see that. And then I'd, like did all that and I did right and left arrows and left and right arrows I'm just messing around with it pretty much trying to figure out like what's what and you know different styles techniques and thickness and whatnot but yeah this is my now before and after I'm getting a little better like you said it's taking some time but my strokes are starting to come into place Slowly, yeah. Like I said, you can't cook a bag of rice just like that. If you don't know, you gotta you gotta learn how to cook and boil the rice, right? Same shit with this microblading. Gotta learn. Gotta practice your strokes and watch videos and training videos and whatnot. And yeah. Thank you, Nama. To God loves you. Then I remember Mama takes the hand for miles. Teach me, me, but it'll be small vegans. We're bringing us so great, not for much go. The love can us be much go. It's all saves. And for not train, no much, or not. And my team All women. Of a dozen.